remember when you said we'd stay together now until forever Just us, just us Said we wouldn't be like all the others Fight and hurt each other Not us, not us Oh, we let each other down, 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 down Yeah, we let each other down, 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 down Oh, we let each other down, 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 down Yeah, we let each other down very similar to France, except here I hear people speaking like not just French, but other languages too. I heard German, I heard another language, but it's so beautiful. And the train was so short. It was actually just like an hour and 15 minutes. It went by so fast and I'm really happy because I was so productive. Like I finished editing um, our lookbook, our Parisian lookbook and yeah so while we're walking i thought that i would talk to you about traveling because i feel like in the past with my anxiety i haven't really spoken about my anxiety that much but um in the past with my anxiety i kind of wouldn't i kind of wouldn't i kind of couldn't really enjoy traveling because I was so anxious all the time and if you suffer with anxiety you know that traveling can really kind of reignite your anxiety so I hated going on trains I hated going on airplanes being in a place that was completely foreign to me was terrifying and seeing how far I've come and realizing how I'm actually like enjoying myself and I'm actually like going on trains I'm going on airplanes I'm going to places new places literally every single day it's so crazy and it's made me realize that mental health really pushes you to enjoy your really great moments because honestly if I had never struggled with anxiety never struggled with traveling never struggled with uh, public transportation that kind of stuff being in new places I don't think I would have enjoyed this trip as much as I am enjoying it, you know what I mean? If you're going through something and it's really shit and it's making you feel like shit, just realize that because of those experiences that you're having, the day when you start to feel better, which you will because mental health is sometimes something that you have to live with or something that people do live with on a daily basis. Like, even though I'm rid of a lot of my traveling anxiety, I still get anxiety more than other people but yeah it's kind of like made me realize that the mental health issues kind of force you to really enjoy yourself a lot more than you would otherwise and so even if you're going through a shit time be grateful for that shit time because you're gonna one day look back on it and be like you know if I never felt that terrible I wouldn't feel and recognize how great I feel right now so but I will talk about my mental health in another video hopefully soon um, kind of like detailing what really helped me because I know anxiety is and has become such like a huge thing among young people so Hola, mi bella gente. So we came to a restaurant. It's called Cafe Novo, and it's so cute. I really like it here. It's really like cozy, and the colors are like you know that coffee shop vibe. That's like really just so nice. It's like that. That did not describe it at all, but yeah, <laughs> it feels so good. So we're just here gonna eat. And then we already checked into our Airbnb. The lady is so sweet. Oh my gosh, she's so nice. And she kind of like gave us a tour of all of Belgium with a map. She gave us a ton of recommendations for where to eat. So yeah, I'm really excited. It's so nice. And it's not that cold, which is good. I thought it was going to be freezing, but it's really nice here. Merci beaucoup. 
Zam girl. So good. This is their Caesar salad. Wow. This is like really good. And it looks like it's actual Caesar salad dressing. Right? Oh, that also looks really good. Mm -hmm. What did you get? Um, linguine, linguine carbonara. Oh, and I also got fries. Yummy. So a little bit healthy, a little bit of nuts. <laughs> it's all about balance, you know? You know, yes. So this is Joanne. Because she kind of has like an old lady short. She has an old lady's shortcut, so that's Joanne. This one looks kind of like an Ivan, right? Looks kind of cool. I feel like Ivan is the name of someone that's like trendy. Yeah, that's Pete. Okay. <laughs> the cactus is. He looks like a Joaquin. This looks like Joaquin. Okay, so we are finally in our Airbnb. Yay, we're here. Oh my gosh, that took forever. But the place is beautiful. The lady was so nice, she was so helpful. She had to like get some stuff done, clean some things, because when we got here it wasn't clean and she was like, please don't look at anything, it's so dirty. Um, but then she went to go, well, she told us to go like eat lunch or something and then she said, I'll let you know when it's ready and it's so cute. There's so much light. Yeah, there's so much natural light. It's so beautiful. She has a little cat here too. So I'm going to show you around a little bit. Okay, so this is the door. You walk in, cute little door right here. And then you walk right in and... I sound like I'm reading a children's book or something. This is the room. It's so, so, so cute. I love it. It's like, it has this very like French bohemian feel to it. I really like, I don't know. I like how she decorated it. It's very simplistic, but still really cute. So it's really nice, really spacious, really big, really pretty. And then here she has like, she has like a little bench, some artwork. And this is the bathroom which is also very, very cute. There you go, there you go. And oh my gosh, I'm so obsessed with these tiny sinks in Europe. They're like, I've seen them so much and they're just so cute. And then you walk on over here and this is like the, I guess that's where the toilet is, yeah. And this is where the I guess this is considered the bathroom with the shower. And it has the bathtub and then the little shower thingy to take a shower. Um, she has her washer and dryer here. She has some nice incense. She's got a little drying rack. Really nice cabinet space, you know. And then you walk on over here. And there's Claudia. This is a living room. It is really cute. It's like very nicely decorated. There's her little cat. Her name is Misha. She's so cute. And then she has a nice chimney that we obviously can't light because there's artwork there or else her artwork would catch on fire. Um, she has like a little dining table. Well, not that's not little. It's like a pretty big dining table. And then more artwork. And what I love about this place is how much lighting she gets in here. It's so pretty. Like there's not a single light on in this entire apartment. And it looks like so luminous already, it's crazy. You could totally film, like you could turn this into a studio. Oh yeah, you could totally like, can you imagine like turning this back wall into a YouTube back wall for like videos? Yeah. And with all this natural lighting, that's like a YouTuber's dream. And then she has a very spacious kitchen. This is like a pretty big apartment, I would have to say. Like even though it has just one room, it still has like an entire thing for the dining room, a thing for the living room, but Yes, this is where we're staying for two days. And I think right now, as you can see, we have Netflix on right now. Well, not on. We're trying to figure out what to watch. Looks like we're going to watch How to Get Away with Murder. It's so good. Have you seen it? No, I've never seen it. It's Everyone so keeps telling me how good it is. I really want to see it. 
but we're gonna watch a little bit of TV because we're literally exhausted. Okay, let me show you this view because, girl, it's so beautiful. Oh my God, I love it. What a beautiful view, oh my God. Like, to be able to wake up to this every single day, like, yes. Please, can I just stay here? It's so pretty. So we went to this, oh, it's G-R-U-U-N. I don't know if you can kind of see it from here, but it's um, it's a coffee shop that we were telling you about. And then we had brunch at this place that's called Novo, Cafe Novo, which is also really good. They had great food and it was delicious. So I love it. It's so beautiful. Belgium, you are treating us like princesses today love it so so now time for netflix and chill so i was just looking out the window and then i was like oh they're building something and then i look closely and i'm seeing that they're moving boxes from the ground to this guy's apartment through this machine i'm like what that is so smart. I wish I had that when I moved into college. <laughs> oh my God, that's so smart. Oh wow, Louis Lyft, you are, you are a smart man, Louis. Hello. We're going to the chocolate shop. Oh. We're going to the chocolate shop and <gasps> I'm so excited. because I put the camera down to like film what we were ordering and this guy and his girlfriend walked in and he looked at the camera he was like oh and then he picked it up and he started filming for us it was so that nice was so funny. yeah it was like, so funny and then they just girl. left <laughs> I know it was so cute but yeah we got our chocolates and now we're gonna go back and eat them and have some dinner because we're both starving. I know, I'm literally like, yeah, famished. I know, me too. And it's so cute. They have the rooftops lined with lights. It's so festive, even though they're probably not celebrating anything, <laughs> but it looks so nice. It's cool how the roofs are. It kind of looks like cookie cutter oh, rooftops. Yeah. yeah. So cute, it looks like a little toy, toy town. I know. watching how to get away with murder and it's so good like it's so good it's really good but it's kind of loud so i'm going to turn it down because i need to i need to show you something i'm back and i thought that i would try one of the chocolates i look like crazy right now because my hair is a, my hair is a mess but i thought i would try one of the chocolates with you because it looks so good um i think this is salted caramel salted caramel maybe. okay so it looks like this okay so i'm gonna try it so there's caramel in the middle oh wow mmm this is so good. It has caramel in the middle. Scoot over. 
Excuse me. Oh, we both got the same one. Yeah. This one, I don't know what it has in the middle. So cute, it's like a little bowl. I know. Mmm. 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 What does it have? What does it taste like? It tastes like chocolate, but I feel like it's not chocolate. I don't know, maybe it's milk chocolate. I it's really know. good. Really? I know. But oh my gosh, it's so good. Really? Yay. I don't want to eat them all today because then I'm going to be sad tomorrow. I'm going to eat all my today. I should do it. Thank you.